All right, folks, this is just a quick video of the cart I made for my Mammoth truck camper. Um, this is a 2017. They're big and heavy. Um, I imagine I'm probably in excess of 5,000 pounds wet, uh, you know, fully loaded with everything. Um, but I simply just made a cart out of two by sixes and some two by fours nailed together. Nothing terribly complicated. Um, I made a trailer tongue for it so that I could uh, pull it in and out of the shop with the can with the with my tractor. Um, I just bought a coupler, uh, two inch coupler from Northern or somewhere, and then welded up some angle iron here uh, that I had laying around, obviously because it's just some old rusty crud. Uh, and then I attached it to the cart with just some of these leg kind of eye bolt things and a pin with with a cotter pin in it. Uh, what's nice about that is I can remove the trailer tongue once it's where I want it to be and I'm not tripping over the trailer tongue sticking out. For casters, I'm using uh, eight inch cast iron casters. I, again, I think I bought these at Northern. Um, the rubber wheeled ones I had, I actually had a, some rubber wheel ones on there um, and they carried the load fine, but they were really hard to push around the shop. Uh, whereas the cast uh, the cast iron casters roll really easily as long as you don't have any rocks or anything in there. So um, they're probably a little undersized, you know, rating wise. I think the front, these front swiveling casters are 2,000 pounds and the rear ones are 1,000, I believe, um, each. So I'm, I'm probably a little over on that. That said, if something were to fail on this thing, the legs on the camper are usually only a couple inches off the floor anyway. So if something happened, it's not like the camper is going to come tumbling down and a big catastrophic failure so anyhow uh just an idea if you have a truck camper i i made this because when we got this mammoth i just i'm about three inches shy from being being able to fit into the door of my shop i've got a a big door but it's just like i said it's just i'm about three inches too too short to to drive it in with it on the truck um so i had to make a cart so i could get it in and out and it's not a terribly difficult thing to do but it works Later.